Hey everyone, I hope you're having a good day and today I am doing a review on a nail polish and the brand is called Venique and I had never heard of this nail polish and it was given to me to review and so I'm pretty intrigued by it and I wanted to share it out with you and I have all the colors on my fingers looking like a crazy person but here is what the brand looks like, Venique. And I'm not sure if you've ever heard of it, but what I seem to be kind of reading and hearing is that it's primarily, you can get it online or you can get it in salons. So it's more of a salon-based nail polish. And I didn't realize, but Essie used to be a salon-based nail polish and now it's mainstream. So hopefully, eventually, Venique will make it, you know, into stores too. But anyway, so I was given these two little sample packs to try out and this one right here is called the mini star gems and it had a little glass nail file and I gave that to my mom because she needed it in her travel bag but that was really cute but these are more of like um, kind of metallic-y um, shades and then this one I was given and it's called the color of desire and this was probably my favorite because it's all the bright colors and it did have one random like um, burnt orangey color but um all of these were pretty much uh, just a cream color so anyway before I get started I pulled up um, some information online about the neek and I wanted to read to you what it says because it kind of it kind of can explain it a little bit you know all in one. So it says, Vanique is a nail polish line made with the latest technology to bring you the most to your manicures and pedicures. Vanique nail lacquer is made with Sil Tech, a silicone based ingredient that causes the polish to be flexible. What does that mean for you? A polish that guards against the annoying chipping and flaking of regular manicures. Plus, Sil Tech works with the infused diamond dust ingredient for extra shiny finish, for an extra shiny fi finish. When the original shine is lost, all you have to do is buff your nails a little and the shine returns. With one coat drying in four minutes, Vanique Nail Lacquer is truly a revolutionary nail polish. So, that's a whole lot and I haven't tried the whole buffing it to see if your color, if your shine comes back because I just read this yesterday. But, I do find that I am a three coat nail polish girl. Like, I always do three coats. And this polish claims one coat and for most of these polishes, that I'm finding is completely true. which totally blows my mind. So, I want to go over these polishes with you. Um, the ones I have on my hand, unless if I tell you different, I have one coat on and that's it. And I do not have a top coat. So, I'm going to go through these first and the first one being Havana Glam and it's just kind of burnt orangey color. Let's see where I have. I have the colors of desire on this hand. So, here is the burnt orangey color. And hopefully you can see it is kind of um, a metallic and metallics don't usually have the shine that um, that like a cream would because it's more of like a true metallic not just a frost so there's that one and then my favorite well I've got probably two favorites in this one is this teal color and it's called sidewalk surfer and here's that one and I have that one on my pinky that right there is one coat. It is so opaque, it is ridiculous. And I, I promise you, I do three coats all the time. And this right here, I got one coat with this teal. So this is probably my favorite out of all of them. I love this teal and it is so opaque. That right there is one coat. I hope you can see the shine because it does have shine. Now to me, it doesn't have the shine that like a sesh feet would, like a gel finish would give you, but it has like a normal top coat shine to it. And when I have, I did about a month ago, I've kind of been sampling through these and it was lasting me with no top coat for about four days with no chips or anything. And that was one coat, no top coat. So that is crazy. And so I didn't let all of them go four or five days because I'm impatient and I like to change my nails. But I did really, you know, this one, it went four full days, no chips, one coat. So, and it does, it says it dries in four minutes. I find that it dries faster than that. So um, there's a few that didn't dry that fast and I'll tell you about those, but it really, 
it dries really fast. I'm saying like a minute for me when I did these last night and it was totally dry. So anyway, there is that one and I also have it over here but it's got a different, there's a different purpose to this one. So anyway, that is the Sidewalk Surfer. Next is Pump Up the Jam and it is this pink and it's kind of like a frosty pink and this is to me more of a top coat. Here is one coat so it's it's pretty sheer. It's not very opaque. But what I've been liking to do with this is paint a hot pink base and then just one coat of a hot pink color and then put one coat of this on top and it gives you this one right here, my middle finger. And so it's kind of has like a holographic-y purpley sheen to it and I think it is absolutely gorgeous. So that is Pump Up the Jam, just a gorgeous pink like shimmery purple under little tones um, top coat color and then next is a really gorgeous color and this one is called Go Galoshes Glow and this is just a true lime and this is just a cream color now here is this one on my finger and if you look at it up close I kind of botched it a little bit this one to me it did take um, I think I did three coats. It was not just a one coat polish. It was more of a sheer consistency, whereas this one was totally just one coat. This one was um, a little bit more sheer. It did take three coats, and because of the three coats, it took a little bit longer to dry, and of course, I messed it up. But if you're looking for a great, um, what am I talking about? <laughs> Nail polish. If you're looking for a great, like, true lime color, this is a great color from Vinique, Galoshes Glow. And it's just a true lime. And, you know, like I said, this was one of the colors I didn't have problems with it chipping. So, you know, and the, everybody's nails are different. I'm not, I'm saying this is how it worked for me. And this is what it's claiming. And I'm going to tell you which ones I noticed worked for me like that and which ones didn't to my recollection. But for the most part, it really, they do shine and they really, they do last. So, loving that one. So that is that collection. So those are, there you go. Okay, next is the mini star gems. So I want to go through those. And the first one, these ones don't have names on them. So I will try to link the names below. I'll try to find them online. But this one is like a pearly, iridescent, um, white color. And this to me is a top coat. Now, I'll show you this one right here. I did like three coats just to build it up so you could kind of see a true color. But you can see it's just a very iridescent color. But I like to layer it over um, just a normal color. So if you see, hopefully it shows up. It offers a lot of shine and it kind of gives it like a mermaid look. Like to me, it this is without it and this is with it. It just adds like a gorgeous top coat and a sheen to what's normally just a cream polish. It turns it into like a really pretty like iridescent polish. So, and these, like I said, these are more metallic and I did just one coat and metallic, they're like true metallic-y polishes, not like a frost polish. So you get a different finish than you would a cream or just a normal um, like a frost like this. This is like a, just a real metallic polish. So here is the purple one right here and that is that one and that's a really neat color it's just very kind of under the radar but just very nice so there is that purple i like that a whole lot and then the next two colors i really love um to me a good like silver true metallic and a true silver a true metallic gold polish are very hard to find and I have sought after like a true gold polish for years like I've got Sephora by OPI I've got a few that I've like spent more money on to try to find a good gold that's not too yellow or whatever but this is a really nice nice gold so here are the gold and silver I'm just going to show them to you like this and again these are very metallic so they have a completely different finish here is the gold that's just one coat usually my gold and yes I have um, a hangnail and I picked at it and it bled Usually, so I'm sorry golds you really got to build them up and then by the time you build them up they're kind of I don't know they're they they look like you had to build them up you could build this one up more but that right there is just one coat of that gold polish so that is pretty impressive for one coat and I really hope it's coming across because it looks very gold and it looks opaque so loving that and then the silver 
here is the silver and here it is on my finger that is also just one coat so those I mean everything I did just one coat besides what I told you was different one coat I mean it's just so so opaque and it has just a true metallic finish so anyway this is a great great line of polish like I said I'm very new to this line and these are the colors that I have to try and for what I've tried and worn and tested and I have tried out all of these as you can tell they really do hold up to what they say there were a few that weren't a one coater but for the most part they were one coat which blows my mind because I always do three coats and that right there this right here just kind of blows my mind in general that that's one coat but um anyway it does have the shine of like my Sally Hansen insta dry it doesn't have like a gel shellac -y shine but it has a normal top coat nice shine and it says it claims that if the shine wears away to buff it now I haven't tried that um, but that is an interesting concept so anyway these polishes I have a little special thing for you um, the salon that sent them to me is called fringe salon and it's here in North Carolina fringe salon and they are giving a special deal to my viewers and what you can do is she's given you 15% off if you order some Vanique nail polish from her salon I don't get anything from this I was just given these polishes to test out so I'm not trying to get commission or anything like that this is just completely a sale for you guys and what you can do is she doesn't have the polishes on her website but what I'm gonna do is I have a website that I just read that from hold on let me show it to you here's the um, the website and it has a list of all the colors I'm gonna link that below in the bottom bar below and you can order from that site but you're not getting the 15% discount and I think a normal size like these are the minis a normal size I think is between seven and eight dollars so about like an SE polish I think they're 750 but I'm not completely sure um, and if you're interested in the mini um, collections they are they kind of rotate these out so you they might not still have these collections but you can always ask when you um, speak with the fringe salon people and you can these I think are about $14 but you're getting like you're getting four minis and two of those equals like a full size so that's you know so anyway fringe is so nice to give us 15% off to my viewers and I will put the coupon code below. It's going to be Fringe15. Um, I'm not sure how long the coupon code is going to be good for. But once it changes or once the coupon code ends, I will put in the information below. And I will put Fringe's website information in the bottom bar below. You can email them. You can Facebook message them. And I'm not sure their phone number is probably on their website too. You could even call them and just tell them the coupon code and that you saw them on my channel and that you want to order some Vanique polish. And here are the color selections. I will list that. Below. I'm telling you, I've been very impressed with this polish and it takes a lot to impress me with polish. And like I said, this one color right here, like, I think it's one of my all-time new favorite colors of all time. And that says a lot. And it's Sidewalk Surfer. So, anyway, a great line. Um, just opaque. For the most part, one coat. They do have um, the shine of, like, a normal top coat. And they really do last. I'm, I mean, for me, they've lasted around four days before I got bored and had to take it off. And I think four to five days is when I noticed chipping but to me one coat no top coat four days is crazy even three days would be crazy with one coat no top coat so anyway that's what they claim my results that's what I saw um everybody's different but that was how it worked for me so anyway I'm so glad to be able to share this with you again I will put the coupon code below and it is Vanique polishes and I hope you like this video if you do like this video please give it a thumbs up if you've ever tried this brand please leave below and let me know how you liked it or what you thought and even where you got it at and again thanks to fringe for sending me these to test out because I have eight new polishes to add to my collection yay so anyway thank you so much if you're not um, subscribed please do subscribe and as always thank you so much for watching and I'll talk to you next time bye